Come Santa Claus here, come Santa Claus right down Santa Claus Lane. Welcome back, gotta love that. The past week, this past weekend was a busy one for Christmas shopping. But there's a good chance you haven't quite checked everyone off your list. That's right. And if you are still searching for some unique gift ideas, you'll find some at Dunwoody's Spruill Center for the Arts. Believe it or not, the center is hosting its 22nd annual Holiday Artist Market right now. And good day, Elena. Paul Milliken is live there this morning. So, Paul, I know you were looking really hard yeah. for something special. You know, for me. you were <laughs> at the top of my list, right? It's Portia, it's Ron, and then it's everybody else after that. So I okay. knew I. I had to get my shopping on because I've done none at all this year. And this is the place to be. It's Spruill Gallery for the Holiday Artist Market. You see right there, it's the 22nd year they've done this. And I'm telling you, you will not get a sense of number one, how much stuff is in here. Number two, how amazing this stuff is on TV. So you have to come in person and check it out. I know Jennifer would love to see you here. This is the gallery director. Great to see you. Nice to see you too. Thanks so this for being is, here. yeah, this is Spruill Gallery, part of the Spruill Center for the Arts. It, it Explain what this gallery is, because I've never been before. Well, the gallery is part of Spruill Center for the Arts, yeah. which is an art education facility here in Dunwoody. Mm -hmm. And the gallery is a different location on Ashford Dunwoody Road, and mm -hmm. we do art exhibits. And every year we do this holiday artist market yeah. full of local artists. Yeah, so let's talk about this artist mm -hmm. market, and Blaze will show you some of the incredible stuff in here. Wh where do you find these artists? I find these artists through our education, education facility yeah. and also um, traveling in the state and going to all yeah. of the other local craft fairs. Yeah, and how many total are represented here? We have over 90 local artists over here. Over 90 local mm -hmm. artists, and, and it ranges the gamut from ornaments to cool stuff for the house to pictures to jewelry. I mean, there is everything in here. So that person at home that's impossible to shop for, we all have one, mm -hmm. you'll find them a gift right here. Jennifer, thank you very much. Speaking of the artists, we have one right here. It just happens to be hanging out this morning. Angeline, great to see you. Good morning. I am upset. 100% officially with your ornaments here. Explain to me what these ornaments are made out of. How do you do this? Thank you so much. I actually create all my designs out of film negatives. Uh -huh. So I cut up film and use that as my medium for design. You can see right here with the wolf, that was a black and white photo negative right there that I just cut up yeah. and then made a wolf out of it. That is so creative. And I love how whimsical all the designs are. My absolute favorite, nobody else better buy this because I'm buying the entire stock. The sloths. I love sloths. I'm totally buying all of those. You've done this artist market before, correct? Yes, for the past three years now. And, and tell me about being part of this market. Do you enjoy it? Oh, I love it. They do such a wonderful job curating local artists and artists around the southeast. And in fact, I get a lot of my holiday shopping done here too. Nice. Well, you and me both, because I'm shopping a lot this morning. Angela, so good to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you. So nice to meet you. You too, and Merry Christmas to you, and Merry Christmas to all of you at home. So again, there's no excuse not to get the perfect gift now that you know about the Holiday Artist Market here at Spruill Center for the Arts. And actually, Blaze, back up if you would. If you go back in this room, I'm going to show you. I, I wouldn't normally show you on TV, but Portia and Ron, I'm going to show you what I'm getting you this year. Uh -oh. I found it. I felt like it was perfect for both of you. Wonderful. You're going to get ornaments that look like bacon. Bacon <laughs> ornaments. <laughs> How amazing is this? Hey, bringing home the bacon. That's all I got to we'll say. Take it. We'll take Too it. bad. You're getting it anyway. It's a dog. <laughs> you're getting it. All right, Paul. Thank you. Well, tomorrow morning, it's sure to be a white Christmas in at least one North Georgia spot. Paul will be uh, live at Stone Mountain Park, which is covered with snow for this year's Snow Mountain. Don't miss the huge high-speed tubing action starting at tomorrow at 8 o'clock.